Years ago, ladies and gentlemen, I became uh, buddies with uh, the late, great T. Lavitz, who's the keyboard player for the Dixie Drags, and played with a bunch of other folks as well, and he played on my first two records back in the day, in the early 90s. And uh, as he was performing, he would always kind of do this, this run, and it, 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 he used it all the time. And at one point I said, T, what is that scale you're using there? And he, <laughs> remember, he's sarcastic. What is this guitar school? I said, shut up and show me the scale. So basically, uh, he called it the Mahavishnu scale. Now, that's not a technical term. It's just what we're calling it. And basically what it is, it's a uh, Mixolydian mode that you're taking out the second scale degree and the sixth scale degree. So you're left with, and a lot of times I'll start on the flat seven. So it's like flat seven, root, major third, fourth, fifth, flat seven, root, so on and so forth. Um, and it has this kind of East Indian flavoring to it. So if I do it in the key of E up here. So he would do stuff like go. I thought, what a cool sound. And then I started messing around with it and doing stuff like. So that I'm kind of hitting a note. And then I, from a whole step or half step down, depending on what the scale is. And then I heard Jeff Beck do a lick that he, that using this scale. Sometimes with, uh, with scales, it's not the notes you put in, it's the notes you take out. And with this, this is a classic example. Uh, another great lick, I heard Jimmy Herring do this kind of variation of a Dickie Betts lick, which is like a... Now that works in a dominant seventh environment really, really well. It also works particularly well if I do like an E sus, or in this case, like a um, same thing would be a D over E. That kind of, you know, kind of a fusion E chord, I guess, for lack of a better term. And doing kind of some kind of a E sus to an E7. Just a really, really cool little uh, um, secret handshake trick. Not a trick. It's just a cool musical spice, I guess we're going to go with. For putting in your gristle stew, put a little bit of that Mahavishnu scale. I said, oh, delicious. So there you have it. Now we're going to play it uh, in a musical environment. You'll see how it works out. Come. <laughs> 